Well, knee pain is, is very, very common, especially with women. And you know, we have these curvy hips and it puts more strain on that knee than um, typically the male, the male structures. Anybody can get knee pain. And you get knee pain usually if it's not a direct impact, like a, you know, a skiing injury or a fall or a blow where you blow out your anterior cruciate ligament or a fracture, you can actually get a lot of the problems from malalignment. And what that means is certain muscles are not working pro properly. There's certain muscles that will tend to get tight and they create a dysfunction on the knee and there's certain muscles that get weak and also create a dysfunction on the knee. And what we wanna do is uh, assess what is actually driving that knee pain and there's very common factors that we find. I would say the major muscles that affect the knee are uh, the gluteus medius which is very very important for any stability in the lower extremity coming from the, the trunk downward is that gluteus medius because its role is very important especially for women to keep that that thigh from internally rotating which puts a lot of pressure on the inside knee it's not only puts pressure on the inside knee between the two big bones but it also changes the alignment of how the kneecap sits in this uh, what they call the trochlear groove of the, the thigh bone so the alignment of the kneecap and the alignment between the the, um, the lower leg and the upper leg that gluteus medius is key the other is uh, the iliotibial band We'll get it's that long it's a very small muscle up at the hip that has this very long tendon that tends to dominate the position of the thigh and if that is really tight that it, it actually makes the gluteus medius even weaker because it will internally rotate the the thigh even more so putting that other muscle at a disadvantage the other muscles that we look at are in the, in the foot and ankle Typically, uh, the anterior tibialis muscle, which comes down the front of the shin, that's very important for stabilizing the foot once your foot hits the ground. 